marriage of Lindsay and Matthew. We celebrate the love that brought them to this day. With love that deepens through many years, may they know its meaning and its mystery, how we become truly one in sharing ourselves and one another, and yet remain two in our own uniqueness. May your house be a place of happiness for all who enter it, and a place where the old and the young are renewed in each other's company. A place for growing, a place for music, a place for laughter. And when shadows and darkness fall within its rooms, may it still be a place of hope and strength for all who enter it, especially for those who may be entrusted to your care. May no person be alien to your compassion. May your larger family be the family of all humankind. And may those who are nearest to you and dearest to you constantly be enriched by the beauty and the bounty of your love for one another. Will the two of you please join hands? No other human ties are more tender and no other vows more important than those you are about to take. Both of you come to this day with a deep realization that the contract of marriage is sacred, as are all of its responsibilities and obligations. Treat yourselves and each other with respect and remind yourselves often of what brought you together. Take responsibility for making one another feel safe and give the highest priority to the tenderness, gentleness, and kindness that your connection deserves. When frustration, difficulty, and fear assail your relationship, as they threaten all relationships at one time or another, remember to focus on what is right between you, not only the part that seems wrong. In this way, you can survive the times when clouds drift across the face of the sun. And remember that just because you lose sight of it for a moment, it doesn't mean the sun is gone away. And if each of you takes responsibility for the quality of your life together, it will be marked by abundance and delight. Who holds the reins? <laughs> your rings say that even in your uniqueness, you have chosen to be bound together. Let these rings also be a sign that despite its occasional sorrows, Love is a circle of happiness, wonder, and delight. May these rings remind you always of the vows that you take here today. Lindsay, please place the wedding ring on Matthew's finger as you repeat after me. I, Lindsay, promise you, Matthew, that I will be your wife from this day forward. To be faithful and honest in every way honor the faith and trust you place in me, to love and respect you in your successes and in your failures, to make you laugh and to be there when you cry, <laughs> to care for you in sickness and in health, to softly kiss you when you are hurting, and to be your companion and your friend on this journey that we make together. <laughs> Matthew, please place the ring on Lindsay's finger as you repeat it. I, Matthew, promise you, Lindsay. I, Matthew, promise you, Lindsay. That I will be your husband from this day forward. That I will be your husband from this day forward. To be faithful and honest in every way. To be faithful and honest in every way. To love you and respect you. To love you and respect you. In your successes and in your failures. In your successes and in your failures. To make you laugh. To make you laugh. And to be there when you cry. To be there when you cry. <laughs> to care for you. To care for you. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To softly kiss you when you are hurting. To softly kiss you when you are hurting. And to be your companion. And to be your companion. And your friend. And your friend. On this journey that we make together. On this journey that we make together. May you strive all the rest of your lives to meet this commitment to each other with the same love and devotion that you now possess. Now, Lindsay and Matthew, since you have publicly promised your commitment to each other for all time, I call upon all gathered here to witness that
that according to the laws of the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania, you are now husband and wife. You may see the 